Hey guys, and today I'm going to be doing a movie review. Well, this is not a movie rant. I'm going to be reviewing a bad movie again, but this time it is it is on a movie from 2018, which becomes my second worst movie of all time, next to Jack Reacher Never Go Back. So I'm going to be reviewing Mortal Engines. Yup, that's right. Mortal Engines is a crappy 2018 movie where Peter Jackson... Robert Sheehan, Hugo Webbing, and Helen Miller, also with Jai Hee and Stephen Lang, and Leo George. So the story of Mortal Engines is where it takes place hundreds of years after a cataclysm event destroyed civilization where a mysterious young Hester Stahl, Shaw, emerges as the only one who can stop the city of London, now a giant predator on wheels, from the boring everything in its path, very inversely driven by the memory of her f mother, Hester joins the forces with Tom Natsworthy, an outcast from London, and Anna Fang. So they have to do whatever they can to get this dangerous outlaw with a bounty on her head. Now, that's the basic plot of Mortal Ranchers. Now, what do I think of this movie? How this movie turned out? I definitely remember watching this movie back in October of 2019. And I gotta say, you guys, Mortal Engines is definitely one of the worst movies of 2018. Definitely one of the worst 2018 movies ever made. Because remember when I said that Hotel Transylvania Dream Summer Vacation was my number one least favorite movie of 2018, but I actually really loved I took it back. Mortal Engines is now my number one least favorite movie of 2018. While Hotel Transylvania 3 Summer Vacation is, is my personal favorite movie of all time. And it's also one of the... And, and it was also one of the best movies of 2018 as well. But not as great as this... Not as great as Mortal Engines. Or not as bad as this one. And I gotta say... Peter Jackson, Robert Jehan, Hugo Weaving, Hel Helmar, Stephen Lang, and Jai Hale did an awful job with this movie. And Kristen Webbers did a, a bad job with this movie. He did horrendous. Like, what Kristen Webbers movie makes it worse? I gotta say, the War of the Wings movies... Directed by Kristen Rivers are so much better than Motor Engines. And I cannot believe I saw this movie. And thank God, this movie's not going to be getting a sequel. Thank God it ain't. Motor Engines doesn't deserve a sequel because it was bad and it could have it, it it bombed at the box office. But I cannot believe that Stephen Lang was in this movie. I mean you want a you want a good Stephen Lang movie? Then go watch Tombstone or go watch Don't Breathe. Those two are so much million times better than Mortal Engines. And also, Hotel Transylvania Dream Summer Vacation. It's no longer my least favorite movie of all time. It is now my favorite movie from 2018, next to Love Simon and Bumblebee and White Boy Rick. I love Hotel Transylvania 3, Love Simon, White Boy Rick, Black Classman, and Bumblebee, which are a million times better than this movie. And this movie should have never existed at all. It should have never existed in the first place. Like, it was written by some teenager or something. What's the point of a teenager writing a, a movie about civilization? And no, I'm I'm not taking this movie way too seriously, just like how I did with the other band movies in the past. And you know what this movie And you know what this rating on Tomorrow Mail gets? Good. It deserves it. A 26% deserves it. It really deserved it. And it, and it definitely bombed at the box office. It definitely did. 
Just like with Triple X, Day in the Union, and a bunch of other bad movies that bombed in the box office, it certainly did bomb at the box office. And if you want a better December 2018 movie, then you should watch Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse or Aquaman. Or The Meal with Clint Eastwood. Those are so much, many times better than Motor Engines. So I will give Motor Engines a zero point, a zero point out of five. A zero out of five. And a thumbs down. Don't watch this movie. Don't ever watch this movie, period. It is now my second least favorite movie next to Jack Reacher, Never Go Back. Which was one of the worst action sequels ever made. And it should not be made at all. At all. And we do not need plans for the, for the Dark film. A Dark film will be unnecessary. But it did, if they did came out with a Dark film, then it should be an improvement over the... Over the second film itself. So. That's it for my movie review. On Motor Engines from 2018. Well this is not a rant. But anyways. Thanks for watching until then. This is Glenn Spenny. STL2001. And see you later.